Today's TBT topic, the truth about self-charging hybrids. Okay, so to talk about self-charging hybrids, we need to do a quick refresher on the basics of a few relevant vehicle types and their features. Conveniently, here's an explanatory matrix we prepared earlier. Along the top, hybrid, plug-in hybrid electric vehicle, which just rolls off the tongue, which is why we call them PHEVs, and finally, battery electric vehicles. There's a few others, but these are the relevant ones for today's discussion. And down the side, okay, just kidding, you can work it out. Righto, let's go through these quickly. Do they have an internal combustion engine? Yes for hybrid and PHEV, and no for battery electric vehicle. On relative battery size, hybrid small, PHEV a bit bigger, and BEV the biggest generally. And finally, plug type, because let's get real here. It doesn't matter if your car takes liquid fuel, electrons, or both. You're going to be plugging into something. So in the case of the hybrid, that's a fuel pump. And for the PHEV, it's both pump and plug. And for the BEV, it's a plug. Now we're up to speed. Let's get to the issue at hand. Recently, a large automaker that begins with a T and rhymes with Oyota produced some new marketing trumpeting this seemingly new class of car called a self-charging hybrid. Now I'm a sucker for new technology, so let's see how the new self-charging hybrid stacks up against the good old hybrid that's been around for 20 years. So same matrix now with the hybrid and the so-called self-charger head-to-head. -head. Combustion engine, same for both. Relative battery size, I think you can see where we're going here. And finally plug type. Yep, you guessed it. Uh, the answer to the final question is yes, it's just the same car. A self-charging car is a combustion engine car. There's nothing new here. Hybrids have been around for 20 years now, so why said car company had to invent a confusing new name to clarify something that wasn't confusing in the first place is anyone's guess. Could be a bit of marketing 101. If you haven't got something new to announce, come up with a new announcement, but who knows. It did send Twitter into a spin though, and a shout out here to the plug seeker who was calling out these ads and retweeting others and we were following along. We've got some links below to a few of those accounts we were watching, but no doubt there were many more including our favourite Fully Charged show, uh, Fully Charged Dan and Robert Llewellyn who was tweeting from Australia. G'day Bobby. Uh, these are worth having a look if you've got some spare time as there's some super smart and funny stuff out there on this topic. To get serious for a second though, the marketing premise that plugs are something to avoid shows just how off base this campaign is. And to ram the point home one more time, we leave you with the wondrous sight of a self-charging car being charged. Please consider subscribing if you like this Tree Blue Tuesday video, and we'll see you next time.